What is up you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome my current subscribers and welcome, welcome, welcome newbies. So glad you guys could join my channel. If you are new to my channel, you guys, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring the little bell and buy my soul child, I super duper appreciate it. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Welcome to Daily Tea. Just saying, just saying. What's up, what's up? Welcome back, you guys. I have missed y'all so freaking much. So, so much, so much. You just have no idea. For real, for real. From the bottom of my heart. Like, for real. Um, let me tell you, what happened was, what happened, what happened, what happened was, was I had every, you know, I was in Florida, me and my kiddos, and, um, I had every intention of taking the cards and doing readings down there, because I was going to test to see if I got messages from Spirit down there, um, that was one of my goals, because I was very curious about it, because I've tested it in my house, and this is the spot, like, this is spot, 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 um, but, what happened was, I, you know, just like everybody does in standard vacation mode, I walked through my house, made sure my air was turned up, all my windows were locked, the doors were locked, you know, the standard stuff you do. Stove was off, all that. Made sure we had everything except for my cards. Just saying. I'm so sad. Tears. Just saying. Um, I realized it. Uh, me and my kids went to go eat at IHOP right before we left the city. Because um, they're having like a $5 special going on right now. Just so anybody doesn't know that. I mean, like you can get a steak burger and fries. They're normally like 11 dollars depending on where you are, what location. Five bucks. For real, for real. So if anybody likes IHOP, just so you know. Uh, but yeah, um, I left my cards. But I didn't realize it until we were getting out of the city. We were probably already about an hour out of the city and um, already on our way and I thought about it I was like oh. and my daughter's like what I was like I think I left my cards and I did sure enough I did um, so I wasn't able to test it so sad um, but we had so much to do down there we just had a blast and so you know everything happens for a reason so maybe it was meant that I wasn't supposed to do reading even though I really really wanted to you can ask my kids I missed it so freaking bad so bad because um, that's part of my life you know um, doing readings for you guys and being on here it's part of my life and it has been since March of 24 sorry my son is making a breakfast in there for us so I apologize um but yes yeah, so um I missed it so much, um, but I left my cards, and I did go in a couple places down there to see if I could find some, um, but there wasn't any I was really interested in, none that really called out to me, um, so I just waited till I came back, so, just saying, but I miss you guys, so, I'll quit rambling on about that, I don't know. but welcome daily tea, welcome, 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 I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, post vacation mode, just saying. Do what, bud? No, Okay. So, just saying. Now, I did do some meditating about 10 minutes previous to clicking the camera on. Um, I did get one message in. Um, I was wondering, since I was so vacation modey, um, if I would. But I did get one message in. So, let me share that real quick. Um, and I did do some meditation down there, but I knew I didn't have my card. So, you know, I was like, well... You know, and actually, I did. Um, I did get one message down there. It was actually the same one that I just got today. So just now. So apparently, somebody really needs to hear that. Um, but you know, of course, I wasn't. I have like a routine here, so um, it, it wasn't like it was down there. You know, I mean, we had. There was a lot going on down there. We stayed in an awesome hotel and went to Universal and. Um, uh, the Islands of Adventure, that Go park on, off of um, um, Universal. Um, so, you know, lots going on. So, a lot different than here because it's quiet and calm usually. Um, a lot quiet and calm than, you know, the hustle and bustle of everybody. But, um, but let me share the message real quick. what I'm trying to say. Okay. Um, okay. The message was... A child energy, 10 and below, masculine, um, is about to start getting um, sick soon. Some, for some of the um, 
masculine child energies, it will be minor. And for some, it will be ongoing and lots of tests and procedures will need to be done. Um, and that's basically the same one I heard down in Florida. Um, just saying. And that's the message I got um, just now when I was meditating. So apparently somebody needs to hear that. Um, I don't know what is going on with the child, masculine child energy, 10 and below. Um, I heard, but it sounds like it's several um, masculine children energies. I heard some it's going to be minor. So, you know, it's just going to be minor illness, maybe a cold, maybe a scratched, um, like a sprain, maybe a, um, like a um, minor fracture. Maybe they fall and uh, hurt their arm, you know. And I heard, but for some, it's going to be many tests and procedures are going to be ongoing to try to figure out what it is. So that's obviously a freaking lot more serious than a sprain or a cut or a um, cold. So for how that resonates, and that's the one I heard down in Florida too. So just to let y'all know, I mean, somebody needs to hear that. So, but I have missed y'all so much. I just want you to know, I truly have from the bottom of my heart. I really have. I have. Um, and if y'all think anybody can uh, benefit from these messages, if you wouldn't mind sharing these on your social media, whatever social media platform you use, like Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, IG, whatever social media platform you use, I would super duper appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I'm just saying. Because it gets the messages out there to people that need or want to hear them. Um, and it gets my channel name out there and it helps it grow, which is awesome. Everybody loves that. But the most important thing is it really gets the messages out to people that need or want to hear them. So, just saying. All right, here we go. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? For newbies just joining that have no clue what I'm doing, this is a, um, I heard try again, and this is what I got. This is a um, daily energy check. It's basically a pulling of the current energy right now in the collective. So, it's um, everybody. I'll just put it up while I'm shuffling. Cast through Sag. Everybody in between. Um, it's daily tea. You never know what you're going to get because it's a uh, pulling of the current energy um it's a more recent pulling so it's supposed to resonate 24 to 72 hours out from the time that you view it however there's millions and billions of people um in the world so and everybody's on different time of life paths so for some it very well can resonate outside the three days range just throwing that out there don't forget the basics time is fluid energy is fluid if it does apply let it fly everybody has free will only take the messages that resonate so just saying but yeah so um you, you never know what you're going to get in the um, the current pulling, is what I'm trying to say, in the um, daily tea. Okay. Ooh. This is what I got. New Moon Promise. Some people are really going to make promises to themselves to really be better people and human beings is what I just heard. Wow. Okay. So some people are really going to make promises to themselves to be better people and human beings. Well, that's awesome. It's always a promise you want to make to yourself or especially yourself. And some people are going to make promises to their partners to be better partners. For serious transgressions in the past is what I just heard. Whoa. So some people are going to make promises to themselves to be better human beings. Which everybody, I feel everyone in the collective as a whole should do that for themselves. For self-respect reasons. For decent human being reasons. Um, and so I heard some people, but for other people, or maybe the same person, if that resonates for you, but another perspective is other people are um, going to make promises to people that are in relationships, um, to their partners, um, to be better partners because of serious transgressions in the past. So for how that resonates for whoever. Okay, well, that's a pretty good one. Okay. Okay, okay. I have missed this so bad. You just have no idea. I mean, I have. Don't get me wrong. I had a blast on vacay. I really, really did. For real, for real. But I had missed this. Because uh, I had a little plan. Like, I was going to. Because, um, like, the hotel brought me in a table and chair so I could do this. Because I was going to. My plan was to go get some cards. Um, at least a standard tarot deck, you know. Um, 
but I couldn't I couldn't even find a standard tarot deck and I found some oracle cards but they just were not calling to me and just saying um, but I couldn't even find a standard standard tarot deck um, so I would have got that but anyways but the hotel brought me in a table and chairs and everything um, and my daughter had you know an assignment doing on that so it wasn't just for tarot reading but you know for several purposes and we didn't want to eat on the bed and all that but um but I couldn't find any decks sad face okay so she really didn't miss it. so um, those are two messages here I got for this one so let me um I feel guided to get tea leaves, I think. I didn't hear it, but I feel guided to get tea leaves. All right, Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? New error, new me is what I just heard. New error, new me is what I just heard. Just now. New error, new me. So, like, I, I heard it like error. I think it's like, not like E-R-R-O-R. -R -R. I think it's like E-R-A. Like, you know, new error. Um, so, like, new, you know, um, E-R-A. -E new error. Error. Error, yeah. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? So, like, turning over a new leaf, basically, is what I'm gathering from that, which is always good, you know? You don't need um, um, New Year's, like a standard New Year's, uh, New Year's resolution or whatever to do that. You can do that anytime, you know? Oh, I heard take them. So, I'm going to take them. Fair man, dealings or relationships with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair. Okay, I just heard this one. An Aquarius and Libra's secret relationship is about to really be broken. Is what I just heard. An Aquarius's and Libra's secret relationship is about to um, be broken. He realized he was being played. Is what I just heard. I heard he realized he was being played. Is what I just heard. So, whoever the Aquarius and the Libra is, there's a, apparently a masculine energy in there. I heard he realized he was being played. So, however that resonates with the Aquarius and Libra. Of course, the Aquarius and the Libra could have Aquarius or Libra and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. However that resonates. But I heard he realized he was being played. So, whether the um, Aquarius is the masculine or the Libra is the masculine... However that resonates, because, you know, energies can be reversed. However that fits in your life. I heard he realized he was being played. So, the masculine energy energy realized he was being played by the other person. Um, and that would make sense. Broken ring, parting of the ways in neither romance or business. And um, I'm assuming for this, he realized he was being played. I guess this is promised to himself, uh, just using this person as an example, whoever this is for. Um, cause that, I think that was spirit message for real. Um, probably the promise to this person, this masculine energy to be a better person, um, a human being to himself, um, and self care and self love, you know, um, not necessarily a promise to be better in the relationship because I heard for, of course this could resonate different for different folks, but for this specific mas masculine energy that's coming in through spirit messages today, He's about to break it off with the Libra because I heard he realized he was being played. So, 
promise, self-care, and self-love with this masculine energy. Then broken ring. Parting of the ways in either romance or business. I'm assuming for this masculine energy, it's for romance. It's, well, I don't know. I heard he realized he was being played. So it could be ma uh, business or it could be um, relationship. It was both for this masculine energy. Really muddled things is what I just heard. And she really, really was using him. Oh, I heard that too. Okay. So it was both for this masculine energy, um, business and romance. Um, but I heard it really muddled things. So I'm assuming the um, mix in the business with pleasure really muddled things for this um, masculine energy. Um, with this other energy, the Libra or the Aquarius, um, and um, it muddled things for them. So that's, I'm assuming that's why he feels like he has to, um, well, and that the uh, other energy was playing him, obviously, and he found that out. So, yeah. And then parting of the ring in either business or romance for this masculine energy. It's for both, apparently. It's both. Several series of chain of events is going to occur with this situation. Balance is going to be restored soon and the masculine energy is going to get his head on straight and do the right thing and that he should have done in the past. Is what I just heard. Okay. So I heard several series of chain of events is going to occur with this situation regarding this Aquarius or Libra, whoever this masculine energy is with the other energy, um, that I heard is going to cause several series of chain of events chain of events are going to occur um, regarding this situation and that he's going to do end up I guess come to his clear senses and do the right thing that he should have done in the past and then balance basically would be restored um, once he does um, get his thoughts together and clear and realize what he needs to do and do the right thing that he should have done in the past whatever that right thing is and how that resonates in this masculine energy's life or whoever how this resonates for you if this resonates for you. Dog close up. Pleasure with a close friend. A meeting is going to occur soon between two energies. In, in, the, in the business realm. Serious business. Masculine and feminine. Okay. So a serious meeting is going to occur soon between um, two energies. It sounds like it's two new energies. That's what it sounds like. New to the feminine and energetic space. Semi-new to the masculine. Is what I just heard. Okay. So semi-new, I mean, it's new to the ma the feminine in the energetic space. That's what I heard from spirit. But semi-new to the masculine. So however that semi-new is. Um, I wonder if this is going secret 70. Um, maybe it was somebody through the hidden camera. Because that would make sense with the semi-new um, of the energetic space. And, you know, being new to the feminine. Because she had, there was a ton of damn people up in that camera. You couldn't tell he high from low to left or right. I mean, there was so many people, but um, but to the feminine it would make sense because she never allowed those people up in the camera, you know. Um, but all those people came through. So the, the, I guess what I'm saying is that would make sense if it was semi new for the masculine. If that was one of the people through the camera, is what I'm saying. And if it was Leo Finn from the Secret Seven, possibly that he's having this business meeting with. Um, because I heard it's business between a masculine and a feminine it's coming soon doing the right thing they should have done in the past um if it does resonate for secret of seven i didn't hear secret seven in here today i mean the messages are really coming in and i was really kind of wondering if they really would but they are um because uh, we're straight into it we're almost 20 minutes in and they're coming in um but if it does resonate for the secret seven that's what i'm trying to say it could resonate different for different folks how would this resonate um 
but it makes me wonder if it's Secret 7 is what I'm trying to say. Um, but I heard a meeting's going to occur between a masculine, masculine and feminine energy business. Um, but it's what it should have been done a long time ago. But it's going to be um, between a masculine and feminine business. It's going to be strictly business at first. Is what I just heard. It's going to be strictly business at first. Really taking care of important um, situations at first. Is what I heard. So it's going to be um, important at first. Um, very important at first. Really taking care of important situations at first. Then down the line, things might be differently. It might be different. Is what I just heard now. Then down the line, things might be different. Okay, that's what I just heard. So, I guess between this masculine and feminine energy, obviously it's going to be strictly business at first, taking care of very important things that should have been taken care of a long time ago. I heard, um, but at first, but maybe down the line, I'm assuming if things, you know, I don't know. However, it might turn out down the line, maybe things will be different. That's what I heard. Archway, new opportunities, possibilities, and paths opening up. The Leo of the Secret Seven is, is about to get several phone calls from businesses that terminated her, offering her positions in the company. That's what I just heard. What the hell? Oh my God, that's what I just heard. Wow. I heard the Leo of the Secret Seven. That's what I heard. Leo of the Secret Seven is about to get um, phone calls from the businesses that terminated her in the past um, for job opportunities in these in these companies. New energies coming in. They realize they really screwed up a good thing, is what I just heard. New energies coming in. They really realize they screwed up a good thing, is what I just heard. Okay, well, that would make sense. Um, so, new energies, I guess, are coming into these companies. New, um, new energies, not the spiteful, angry, evil people that were basically out to get this poor single woman um, of kids. Um, you know, malicious, spiteful, crazy people. It's new energies, apparently, in these companies now that terminated uh, this poor single mother of children. Um, and um, they realized it's a group of good things. So, I'm assuming, you know, phone calls from, I'm assuming, different people. And I'm assuming probably with apologies. Some are going to be letters and some will be phone calls, is what I just heard. Some will be letters and some will be phone calls. Okay, so some I'm assuming the communication. I heard first I heard phone calls. But, or I heard yeah, I heard phone calls, didn't I? I think I did. You have to go back and replay it. I think it was phone calls. But um I heard phone calls in but some will be letters. How that resonates. Scales keep your life in balance. There's going to be a possible romantic opportunity soon for many energies, including the Leo of the Secret Seven, is what I just heard. There's going to be um, romantic opportunities coming soon for um, many energies, I heard, um, including the Leo of the Secret Seven, the Leo Femme of the Secret Seven. Really use your best intuition and ask lots of questions. That's what I just heard. Really use your best intuition and ask lots of questions. The energy really interested in the Leo of the Secret Seven is very caring. And direct. That's what I just heard. Oh, wow. 
So the energy interested in the Leo of the Secret Seven, I heard, is very caring and direct. Well, that's freaking amazing. I mean, that's what you want. You want somebody very caring and direct. Because um, if they're very direct, they're going to tell you how they're feeling, what their thoughts are, their thought processes are. Thought processes are. Um, they're going to tell you whether it's good or bad, and you want that. You, I mean, you need that in a relationship. If this is, it sounds a little relationshipy there at the end, um, possible. But you want that, whether it's good or bad. Hey, my toe hurts. Hey, my butt hurts. Hey, your butt head. Hey, you know, I love you. You know, uh, you you need that kind of directness um, in your life, um, I feel like everybody does. Um, but I heard the uh, energy that is really interested in the Leo, the Secret Seven, is very caring and very direct. Well, I would want that as a partner for me personally, caring and direct. Those are two wonderful combinations right there because you know what you're going to get, good or bad, in the directness department. And obviously they care enough to tell you whether it's good or bad, so you want that. Um, because somebody that's going to lie to you, um, that's not good. I don't care if they're trying to save you or whatever they think they're trying to do. No, 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 no. You want somebody direct. For real, for real. You really, really do. Um, at least I would. I mean, everybody's different. Maybe some people like um, to be lied to and, you know, patting the blue or whatever. I don't like that. I like, won't you be direct with me? So, I mean, that's good, in my opinion. Let me see if I hear anything else. Wonderful connections are being formed between people soon that need to be, that need and should be formed. So wonderful connections are going to be formed soon between people that need and want, uh, need and want, want and need to be formed. How that resonates for folks. And connections are falling away where they need to fall away is what I just heard. And connections are falling away where they need to fall away is what I just heard from Sphere. So connections are being formed soon. Is what I heard from spirit that need and that want and need to be formed, um, and connections are falling away where they need to be um, want and need to be falling away. Balance really being brought into play for a lot of energies is what I just heard. Balance really being brought into play for a lot of energies. Well, that's good. I mean, you want balance. I mean, I don't know about you, but I want balance in my life, or balance, period. Um, and that's good. I mean, balance is always a good thing. I mean, we have the skills card, so just saying. Oh, so freaking lootly. Okay. Well, I think we're done. I mean, my goodness, I'm at 28 minutes. Um, I've missed you guys so much. You just have no idea. I for real, for real have. I have missed y'all so much. So much. Big heart. Just saying. Uh, so much. I think I might do a collector reading here in a minute, or I might get started on the bi-weeklies, um, because I want to get the bi-weeklies out for y'all. I'm going to work on those all day today, because my daughter has a big test coming up in a couple days, so today is R&R &R day for her. She's back there studying, doing her thing. I told her she just focus on her. Me and my son have a little bit of cleaned up due, but not much. Um, so my point is, we're at home all day today for her, but after the cleaning I'll be sitting here and I'm going to do readings for y'all so uh, hopefully I'll get Capsu Sag done today all 12 for bi-weeklies for the end of October uh, mid to end of October done today I'm hoping um, I'm hoping we'll see how it goes I'm not going to rush them I want to take each reading one by one and see if I can get messages in um, so I'm not going to rush them so I'm just letting y'all know but, um, but that's what I'll be doing today but I've missed y'all a ton. Um, donations are super greatly appreciated. Just saying, just saying. These are all free readings. So let me show you the cards one more time. Um, so if you would like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. Um, all donations are super duper greatly appreciated. Just saying, just saying. Single mom raising two kids. Just saying. Um, and that's it. I will see you guys later. Please share these videos um, if you think anybody could benefit. Uh, love you guys. Namaste.